Now prepare yourself, boys. This is where things go Wamo Cablamo and Sano style. The hell did you just say, Joe? What do you mean by that? Every single animatronic is on the loose. Freddy, Chica, Bonnie, and Foxy will be peeking through the curtain. The difficulty really starts to ramp up here. I hope they come one at a time. I'm not good with groups. Stormy would probably agree with that. What the hell is happening? Hallucinations. They become more frequent as the nights go on. Our character must be off his meds then. That's how you know we're playing as Sleepy Joe. Can you two babbling idiots go one second without insulting each other? No. no. Damn it, I should have just went to Michelle's book club. Obama, you know very well she would just be reading her own book. I know, that's why I avoided it. Jill and I used to have that relationship until I finally took charge and showed her that I'm wearing the pants in the relationship. I don't know what I'm more surprised at, that your wife is still alive? or that you remembered to put on pants. Both, if I'm being honest. You guys could have just nodded in agreement. But that's the thing, I don't agree to it. For goodness sakes, Joe, if she walks you around like a seeing-eyed dog, that's not normal. If you weren't standing in office, I'm confident she would have put you in a nursing home already. You certainly have a way with words, Donald. Why is this duck chicken thing being the one to rush the door? Normally it's Bonnie. What is Chica anyways, Joe? Are you fucking serious? She's a chicken, Barack. It's right in her damn name. I expected something like that from Donald, but from you too. Come on now. No need to get snippy. She looks like a duck. I don't know why she would be a chicken. Now look at who's questioning video game logic. That's the stare of nightmares. Why can I see her through the door? Just the way the developer wanted it. Well, he didn't have to develop her staring like that. Close your mouth. You're letting flies in. I'm surprised you can make jokes and play the game at the same time. Yeah, it comes with the territory of being a business owner. You have to dip your hands in a lot of areas at once. You get pretty good at multitasking that way. So trade out bankruptcy for tax evasion, and you got a pretty good business. The art of the deal, as Mr. Donald Trump would say. That's weird. Hey, Bonnie is still on the stage, and he's normally the first one out. That's super weird. The night is still going smooth. Hasn't really been too much activity besides Chica. You're right for once, Joe. The thing that gets me is that building anxiety of the night. As the clock gets closer to 6 a.m., it gets more and more nerve-wracking to play, like waiting for everything to crash and burn. Just wait until the second game. I've seen previews of it, and it actually looks tougher than running the country. Well, yeah, presidents do like five things. This seems like a nightmare job. This man should be running the country. I did at least six. No wonder your approval ratings are in the toilet. I was the most liked president in the past 100 years. The absolute best, the very best one. Who told you that one, New York Post? Oh, she looks possessed. She looks like you, Donald. How does she even look like me? She's orange. Wow, Comedy Central over here. Someone give Obama a fucking nomination for an award. Have you put on that orange paste recently? You've been looking a lot more normal. No, but I've been checking Foxy like crazy. You're not running down here tonight, you furry bitch. Come to think of it, that's the only thing we've died to, right? Yeah, kind of rough for new players, but he just becomes a formula once you get it down. Well, not to brag, but he doesn't hold a candlestick when I've laid the lumber. Even if it's false confidence, confidence is key. How is Bonnie still on the stage? Normally, he's busy gargling on the deepest part of my shaft. A little bit too detailed for me, but I will say it's not necessarily a bad thing that they're staying behind. Well, yeah, Joe, that's common sense. But it's just that off-putting factor. Don't you dare talk to me about common sense when you stared at the damn sun. You're just mad you don't have the neck capacity to look up. The hell was that? Sounded like laughing. Oh, no. Oh, f they're all out. Wait, what? You heard me, Obama. Everyone is out. Every single one of them are on the loose and after us. Call Secret Service. Tough news, Secret Service doesn't arrive until 6 a.m., so you better keep a close eye on those cameras. Welcome to the working class, Donald. A hard straw for you to grasp, but this is life in America for most people. I didn't ask for this to be an electoral speech, Obama. I asked to call Secret fucking Service. There's a thing called a bullet that I hope you get hit by. Well, I'm not going to lie, boys. It's 5 a.m. and I have 25% power. Even if I close all the doors and use my camera, I'm still set to win. I cannot believe you're actually good at this. You of all people, good at Five Nights at Freddy's. What a world we live in. You consider that crazy? We're three of the most powerful men in the world just sitting here playing a horror game. Makes you think, doesn't it? You guys are so far up each other's asses, I can't tell where Joe ends and Obama begins. It surprises me how your bedside manners are equivalent to a masochist sow. So basically, Hillary Clinton? Yes. And the master himself rings in another one for the team. It's okay, you bench warmers can also hold the trophy too. Shove it, Don. It's hard to believe it's the fourth night. Once we win, what should we do to celebrate? I have a realtor friend that owns an island that we can visit. Mm, this can't go wrong in any way whatsoever.